Urban exploration, a journey into the overlooked and forgotten pockets of our built environments, often uncovers stories and mysteries that lie dormant within abandoned structures. With an essence of unease and thrill, we delve into 20 chilling discoveries made by these explorers. Number one, an abandoned asylum with all records intact. In the heart of a sprawling, abandoned asylum, nestled in layers of dust and silence, urban explorers chanced upon an eerie spectacle, a sea of untouched medical records. Each patient's story was meticulously preserved, their psychological contours captured in ink, now lying in forgotten folders. The asylum, a time capsule of the distant past, was an unsettling display of the treatment and understanding of mental health in previous decades. As explorers navigated through the labyrinth of dilapidated hallways, they noticed walls punctuated with strange art, presumably the work of the asylum's former residents. Weather-worn murals painted a vivid picture of the thoughts that once echoed in these spaces, almost serving as cryptic memoirs of those who once occupied these rooms. The paint, despite its peeling state, held a vibrancy that contradicted the somberness of the environment. Yet perhaps the most unnerving element was the silence. It was an absence of sound that carried a heavy weight, one that was punctuated only by the soft rustle of parchment and the echoing footsteps of explorers. The asylum was a chilling reminder of practices now considered archaic, its quiet hallways a stark monument to a bygone era. Number two, a deserted hotel filled with mannequins. The grandiosity of abandoned hotels often serve as poignant reminders of their bustling past, but one such edifice brought a whole new meaning to vacancy. Upon entry, urban explorers were met with an unsettling sight, a legion of mannequins staged in lifelike positions. Each room hosted a different tableau, with plastic inhabitants frozen in moments of a time that never really existed. In the lobby, mannequins were poised mid-conversation, their glossy eyes reflecting the faint light that permeated the dust-covered windows. An unsettling eeriness hung in the air, as though these lifeless figures were paused, waiting for an interruption to animate them once again. In the silence of the deserted hotel, the presence of these human imitations lent an uncanny air. As explorers navigated through the mannequin-filled hotel, they moved through a frozen narrative, an eerie pantomime that echoed in the stillness of the abandoned space. These unblinking residents of the forgotten hotel served as a haunting testament to its empty grandeur, embodying an unsettling blend of past opulence and the stark reality of desertion. Number 3. A tunnel network covered in unexplainable symbols. Urban explorers, while venturing into the subterranean network of a long-forgotten city tunnel, stumbled upon an unsettling sight, walls covered in symbols that defied explanation. The bewildering array of signs etched into the stone with precision and care created a bizarre codex that seemed to hold hidden meanings lost to time. The tunnels, dark and claustrophobic, stretched out in labyrinthine coils beneath the bustling city. The flickering lights from the explorers' torches danced upon the enigmatic symbols, casting eerie shadows that made the inscriptions appear almost animated. Every curve, every line seemed to ripple with unspoken narratives and cryptic messages. Even as the symbols bore the weight of possible historical significance, their strange and untranslatable nature lent an aura of unease. Navigating the cold, dark tunnels, the explorers moved through an eerie, silent narrative, written in an indecipherable language that echoed with the whispers of its mysterious authors. Number 4. A hidden basement full of dolls in an old house. In an old house, fallen into disrepair, a concealed basement was discovered by urban explorers, and within it they found a disconcerting sight, hundreds of dolls, their glassy eyes reflecting the dim light from the explorers' torches. The dolls, of different shapes and sizes, were carefully arranged on dust-covered shelves that lined the cold stone walls. Their tiny faces, etched with delicate features, stared blankly into the room, their lifeless gazes giving the space a spectral ambiance. Each doll, with its unique attire and posture, seemed to be frozen in a perpetual state of anticipation. Some dolls appeared ancient, their cracked porcelain faces and faded clothing hinting at their vintage origins. Others were more modern, 
their plastic skin still retaining a hint of its original luster beneath the dust. The chilling silence of the basement was punctuated only by the explorer's careful footsteps and the distant, hollow echo of the old house settling on its ancient foundations. The multitude of lifeless eyes that followed their movement seemed to cast an unseen veil of tension over the explorers. Despite their inanimate nature, the dolls in their quiet, clandestine alcove managed to spin an uncanny tableau of the house's forgotten tales, cloaked in mystery and eerie tranquility. Number 5. A Decommissioned Subway Car Buried Beneath the City Deep beneath the pulsating energy of the city, a team of urban explorers discovered a decommissioned subway car. Its existence, forgotten by time and progress, posed as a grim monument to the past. The sight of the metallic beast, still sitting on disused tracks, beneath layers of dust and darkness, was chilling. Inside, the subway car bore an eerie reflection of a world frozen in time. The seats, though aged and worn, retained the impressions of the last passengers. Faded advertisements hung from the overhead frames, their promises and slogans echoing an era gone by. Graffiti, the language of rebellion and expression, adorned the walls and windows, frozen in the subterranean silence. The uncanny solitude of the place, the chill of the underground air, and the spectral image of the abandoned car created a disquieting atmosphere. As the explorers traced the forgotten paths of commuters, they stepped through a slice of history, untouched and unchanged, buried beneath the bustling cityscape above. Number 6. A Strangely Preserved Time Capsule Home Urban explorers ventured into a house seemingly preserved in time, offering a bizarre glimpse into a past era. The home, left untouched for decades, still held remnants of the lives that once thrived within its walls creating a surreal tableau that made for an uncanny exploration. The house was a perfect time capsule, every object left in place as though awaiting the return of its occupants. An open newspaper on the coffee table bore headlines of historical events, its yellowed pages crisp with age. A table was set for dinner, its china and silverware layered with dust. Bedrooms were still adorned with personal belongings, books left mid-read, and wardrobes filled with outdated fashion. Family photographs adorned the walls, their smiles frozen in sepia tones. Children's toys were scattered across the floor, the echo of laughter long since faded. The explorers moved through this untouched space, the air heavy with the strange blend of nostalgia and the uncanny. Despite the absence of visible decay, the house was undeniably a relic. As the explorers moved through rooms trapped in the past, they experienced a haunting journey into a life left behind, marked by the unsettling serenity of an existence preserved yet forgotten. Number 7. A Forgotten World War II Bunker In an obscured corner of a dense forest, urban explorers came across a relic from the Second World War, an abandoned bunker, its cold, concrete exterior now overgrown with moss and foliage. The bunker, a mute testament to the brutalities of war, was an eerie contrast to the tranquility of its forest surroundings. Inside, remnants of military life were preserved in the gloom. Rusting beds, their thin mattresses now home to colonies of fungi, sat aligned against the damp walls. Tattered maps, their once vital information now blurred by time, clung to the decaying walls. Debris of outdated weaponry and communication equipment added to the bunker's chilling aura. The bunker, a forgotten capsule of a tormented era, bore witness to stories of fear, valor, and longing. Each artifact was a tangible connection to a period where survival was paramount and freedom a distant dream. As the explorers treaded this forsaken ground, they moved through an echo of the past, where the shadow of war loomed large, leaving an indelible imprint on the walls of the silent bunker. Number 8. A School Abandoned Mid-Lesson Among the forgotten structures that urban explorers often encounter, an abandoned school stands out for its particularly poignant resonance. One such edifice, found frozen mid-lesson, offered an uncanny glimpse into an interrupted day of education, its silence echoing the absence of young voices. Classrooms were still filled with desks, their surfaces scarred by the etchings of past students. The chalkboard bore traces of lessons that were never completed, the handwriting faded but discernible. 
The date, inscribed on the board, served as a stark reminder of the day when the school's rhythm was abruptly paused. The school, once a haven for learning and growth, now stood as an eerie monument to an unfulfilled academic year. As explorers navigated the desolate classrooms and hallways, they traversed a haunting narrative of interrupted childhood, a spectral symphony of silence where once there was noise, life, and learning. This school, abandoned mid-lesson, served as an uncanny testament to the fragile temporality of everyday life, its stillness echoing a chilling tale of sudden desertion. Number 9. An Uninhabited Island with Mysterious Structures On a remote, uninhabited island far from the prying eyes of civilization, urban explorers discovered a perplexing sight, a collection of enigmatic structures shrouded in mystery. These architectural oddities, scattered across the island's rugged terrain, bore no resemblance to any known purpose or design, leaving explorers with a sense of both awe and unease. The structures, weathered by time and nature's elements, defied easy categorization. Some appeared as dilapidated dwellings, their walls encrusted with layers of moss and ivy. Others resembled peculiar monuments or cryptic formations that seemed to defy explanation. The purpose behind these structures remained hidden, their origins lost to the passage of time. As explorers delved deeper into the secrets of the island, they discovered peculiar artifacts and remnants of a forgotten civilization. Pieces of pottery, fragments of intricate carvings and discarded tools hinted at the presence of a bygone society. Yet without any written records or verbal accounts, the island's enigma remained intact. The silence that pervaded the uninhabited island was palpable, interrupted only by the rustling of leaves and the lapping of waves against its shores. The mysterious structures, standing as sentinels of an enigmatic past, invited speculation and conjured tales of a lost civilization that had once thrived in isolation. Number 10. An Underground City, Hidden Beneath the Streets Beneath the bustling streets of a modern city, urban explorers uncovered an astonishing secret. An expansive underground city, long forgotten and concealed from public knowledge. This subterranean labyrinth, a hidden marvel of engineering and human ingenuity, offered a chilling glimpse into a world beneath our feet. Navigating through tunnels and chambers, the explorers discovered a parallel cityscape complete with streets, buildings, and even remnants of ancient infrastructure. The underground city, seemingly frozen in time, hinted at a complex network of tunnels that had once served as a clandestine refuge or perhaps a covert hub for illicit activities. As explorers pieced together the fragments of this hidden city, they unraveled a haunting narrative of a forgotten society. The underground metropolis, shielded from the surface's bustling activities, revealed a clandestine existence that had persisted for unknown lengths of time. In their exploration, the adventurers were reminded of the depths beneath our everyday lives and the mysteries that lie hidden, waiting to be unveiled. Number 11. A mansion left with a banquet still laid out. Urban explorers stumbled upon a mansion frozen in time, where an eerie scene awaited them. A banquet hall adorned with opulent decorations still bore the remnants of an unfinished feast. The long-abandoned mansion stood as a haunting reminder of the past grandeur, its halls echoing with whispers of forgotten celebrations. As the explorers entered the banquet hall, they were greeted by a surreal sight. The long dining table, draped in an ornate cloth, was set with fine china, crystal glasses, and silverware, each piece coated in a thin layer of dust. Plates of half-eaten food remained, their contents now decayed and decomposed. Wine glasses sat untouched, their contents evaporated over time. The room itself exuded a peculiar aura. Faded chandeliers cast a dim, melancholic light, reflecting off the tarnished silverware and casting distorted shadows on the deserted walls. The silence, broken only by the explorer's careful footsteps, carried a weight of anticipation, as if the guests had momentarily stepped away leaving the room suspended in time. The grandeur and extravagance of the mansion, juxtaposed with the eerie stillness, created an unsettling atmosphere. The explorer's presence disrupted the delicate equilibrium, as if they were intruding on a forgotten celebration, surrounded by spectral guests. As the explorers left the mansion, they couldn't shake off the feeling of a lingering presence. 
The banquet hall, with its suspended feast, served as a poignant reminder of fleeting moments frozen in eternity, a poignant testimony to the transience of opulence and the inevitable passage of time. Number 12. A Silent Movie Theater Forgotten in Time Within the depths of an urban landscape, urban explorers discovered a forgotten movie theater, its faded marquee a relic of a bygone era. Stepping inside, they were transported to a different time, where the magic of cinema once unfolded upon the silver screen. However, this theater now lay silent and abandoned, its seats empty, and its memories trapped within its decaying walls. The explorers ventured further into the theater, their footsteps muffled by the layers of dust that coated the worn carpet. Rows of red velvet seats, now faded and threadbare, stretched before them, each bearing the marks of countless moviegoers. The air hung heavy with a sense of nostalgia, as if the echoes of laughter, applause, and dialogues from forgotten films still lingered in the shadows. As the explorers immersed themselves in the abandoned theater, a bittersweet atmosphere settled around them. The silence was palpable, broken only by the occasional gust of wind through broken windows or the faint creaking of the structure. Number 13. A hospital with rooms filled with unopened medicines. Within the confines of an abandoned hospital, urban explorers made a chilling discovery. Rooms filled with shelves upon shelves of unopened medicines. The hospital, now devoid of life and purpose, stood as a stark testament to the fragility of health and the passage of time. As the explorers ventured through the corridors, they entered rooms filled with boxes and containers, each holding a promise of healing and relief. Medicines, neatly arranged and untouched, lined the shelves, their expiration dates long surpassed. The sterile environment, once bustling with doctors and nurses attending to patients, now harbored a disconcerting stillness. The labels on the medicines bore the names of ailments and diseases, their contents intended to provide comfort and remedy. Yet their unopened state hinted at the abrupt halt in the hospital's operations, leaving the medicines as silent witnesses to a time when this space teemed with healing and hope. The explorers moved cautiously through these forgotten rooms, the scent of chemicals lingering in the air, a subtle reminder of the purpose this place once served. The weight of unfulfilled prescriptions and unrealized recovery seemed to hang in the atmosphere, evoking a sense of melancholy. Number 14. A Church with Cryptic Inscriptions Nestled within the quiet embrace of nature, urban explorers stumbled upon a forgotten church, its walls adorned with cryptic inscriptions. The ancient stone structure, weathered by time, became a canvas for enigmatic markings that defied easy interpretation, offering a mysterious glimpse into the church's hidden history. The explorers traced their fingers over the inscriptions, their significance lost in the passage of years. The letters and symbols etched into the stone walls formed intricate patterns that evoked a sense of arcane knowledge and hidden messages. It was as if the church walls whispered secrets that only a chosen few could decipher. As the explorers ventured deeper into the church, they discovered hidden alcoves and chambers, each bearing its own set of inscriptions. Symbols and motifs intertwined, creating an intricate tapestry of mysterious meaning. The silence of the church seemed amplified, as if the inscriptions held the key to unlocking a forgotten narrative. Number 15. An empty zoo with animal cages intact. Deep within the heart of an overgrown wilderness, urban explorers stumbled upon an empty zoo, its animal cages still standing as remnants of a forgotten era. The air was thick with a sense of abandonment, as if the spirits of the creatures that once called this place home still lingered amidst the enclosures. The explorers walked along the overgrown paths, their footsteps muffled by layers of fallen leaves and vegetation. As they approached the animal cages, a haunting sight greeted them. Each enclosure remained intact, a silent testimony to the lives that once resided within. The cages, now rusted and dilapidated, stood as empty shells, their bars serving as ghostly reminders of the creatures that once paced restlessly within. Faded signs displayed the names and species of the long-gone inhabitants, the letters barely discernible after years of neglect. The explorers couldn't help but feel a somber sense of connection to the forgotten animals that once brought joy and fascination to visitors. 
The enclosures, now overgrown with weeds and vines, seem to reclaim the territory that once belonged to the creatures as nature slowly reclaimed what was once tamed. Number 16. A Vintage Amusement Park, Consumed by Nature Hidden within a dense forest, urban explorers uncovered a vintage amusement park, now consumed by nature's relentless grip. The once vibrant rides and attractions stood in stark contrast to the encroaching foliage, evoking a sense of eerie nostalgia and the passage of time. As the explorers ventured deeper into the park, they encountered rusted roller coasters, their tracks intertwined with gnarled branches. Dilapidated Ferris wheels, now motionless, towered over the landscape, their seats empty and swaying gently in the breeze. Carousel horses, their paint faded and chipped, seemed frozen mid-gallop, forever trapped in a moment that no longer existed. The explorers navigated through the overgrown paths, their footsteps a symphony of crunching leaves and snapping twigs. The laughter and screams that once filled the air were replaced by a haunting silence, occasionally interrupted by the distant hoot of an owl or the scurrying of small creatures amidst the undergrowth. The explorers couldn't help but imagine the joyful memories and laughter that once filled the air, juxtaposed against the current stillness and abandonment. The vintage amusement park became a poignant reminder of the ephemeral nature of entertainment and the inevitable cycle of growth, decay, and rebirth. Number 17. An old factory full of unmade toys. Nestled within the industrial district, urban explorers stumbled upon an old factory, its interior frozen in time, brimming with rows upon rows of unmade toys. The factory, once a hub of creativity and manufacturing, now stood as a haunting reminder of halted production and lost dreams. As the explorers stepped into the factory, they were greeted by a surreal sight. Countless workstations lined the expansive space, each cluttered with molds, materials, and half-finished prototypes. The air carried a faint scent of plastic and paint, remnants of a manufacturing process that had come to an abrupt halt. The unfinished toys, frozen in various stages of production, seemed to yearn for the touch of skilled hands that would bring them to life. Doll heads, limbs, and bodies lay scattered, awaiting assembly. Stacks of fabric and piles of stuffing hinted at the whimsical characters that could have adorned children's rooms. Number 18. A forgotten laboratory with scientific equipment left behind. Hidden within a forgotten corner of the city, urban explorers unearthed a long-abandoned laboratory, its shelves lined with scientific equipment left behind. The laboratory, a relic of past research and experimentation, held a captivating ambiance that whispered of forgotten discoveries and untold stories. As the explorers cautiously entered the laboratory, they were met with a captivating scene. Microscopes, test tubes, and beakers stood untouched on laboratory benches, as if awaiting the return of diligent researchers. Glassware containing mysterious substances hinted at experiments left unfinished. The secrets they held forever locked away. The explorers moved through the laboratory, their footsteps echoing in the quiet space. The air carried a faint scent of chemicals, a testament to the countless experiments conducted in pursuit of knowledge and understanding. The laboratory seemed to hold an invisible presence, as if the spirits of scientists and researchers lingered, their intellectual pursuits frozen in time. Number 19. A Military Base with Abandoned Tanks Deep within a desolate landscape, urban explorers uncovered a forgotten military base, its grounds littered with abandoned tanks, remnants of a bygone era of warfare. The base, once a site of strategic importance, now lay in eerie stillness, a haunting testament to the conflicts and tensions of the past. As the explorers traversed the decaying grounds, they encountered rows of weathered tanks, their metal hulls a stark contrast against the barren landscape. These once mighty war machines, now covered in rust and surrounded by overgrown vegetation, served as solemn reminders of battles fought and lives affected. The silence that permeated the military base seemed to carry the weight of lost battles and forgotten sacrifices. The explorers couldn't help but contemplate the human experiences encapsulated within these abandoned war machines. They were confronted with the stark reality of the destructive power that these tanks once held, juxtaposed against the now peaceful surroundings. Number 20. An eerie underwater city visible through clear waters. 
Beneath the surface of crystal clear waters, urban explorers chanced upon an otherworldly site, an eerie underwater city, its structures and remnants visible through the aquatic depths. This submerged metropolis, frozen in time, held a haunting allure as if the ghosts of a forgotten civilization still roamed its submerged streets. As the explorers delved deeper into the underwater city, they discovered a surreal landscape. Dilapidated buildings stood as haunting sentinels, their windows empty and dark. Streets and alleys, now overgrown with algae and marine life, hinted at the former bustling life that once inhabited this submerged world. As they ventured further, the explorers discovered remnants of human activity, fragments of sculptures, corroded signage, and decaying remnants of vehicles. The underwater city seemed to preserve fragments of a bygone civilization, suspended in a state of perpetual tranquility. The play of sunlight through the water, casting ethereal rays that illuminated the submerged structures, added an extra layer of mystique to the scene. The explorers were immersed in a world that defied the passage of time, where the physical remnants of human endeavor were locked in a delicate dance with the aquatic environment.